this morning on Core Explorers, an incentive to keep your holiday shopping local this year. Right now, dozens of small businesses around the Portland Metro are participating in the second annual Shop Small, Win Big event. Core Harlan joins us live in Southeast Portland to learn how shoppers can earn prizes just by visiting a local store. Hey, Core. Oh, Al, Emily, this is a great program designed to get more people's holiday spending dollars into the hands of local makers, local merchants, and everything else. We have been around to a couple of different shops already this morning. We're at Plural Collective along 13th and Selwood here, right across from the Grand Central Bakery for folks who are in the neighborhood here and know this, uh, know this location. And the beauty of Plural Collective is that there are actually 10 different female-owned businesses under one roof right there. So we're on the uh, upstairs part of the deal here. Downstairs, there is a, a shop down there. Everything from sweaters, plants, handcrafted uh, home decor items, uh, scarves, uh, you name it. Little small succulents that you put in a windowsill somewhere. And it's just cool. There's probably thousands and thousands of little trinkets and things in here that are great for the holiday shopping season. I'll come back around here and introduce you to Allison over here who's giving me a hard time, right? Let's not stand in front of the swear socks. I don't want to see swear socks, okay? I love swear socks. <laughs> okay, right here. Here's a good. All right. Hey, good morning. Good morning. How you doing? Good. All it's right. a little early, but good. Well, it's a lot early. It's a lot good. early. Tell me about Plural Collective, would you please? Well, Plural Collective is, um, like you said, we're 10 women-owned businesses in here, and most of us um, not only sell stuff here, but we work in this space as well. Um, so you're makers, in addition to, to sell to business people, you, you make the stuff, yep. right? Yep. All right. What, uh, uh, how, I mean, we're trying to get into kind of a, a theme here of directing more people's disposable incomes mm -hmm. towards local merchants. How big of a deal is that in the holiday shopping area? We think it's huge. Um, not only during the holidays, but year round. I mean, the support that we've had the last four years that we've been here is incredible our community has been super supportive people love shopping here people who haven't been here before come in and they just love the fact that they can do a lot of shopping here under one roof yeah. there's 10 different businesses in this small mm -hmm. space here and again this is with an idea to keep local makers and local merchants top of mind when it comes to holiday shopping as carl's kind of showing you around here there's plenty of things to see plenty of things to buy plenty of stuff stocking stuffers and all the rest of that. All right, let's bypass the socks. I love these socks, but they got a bunch of dirty words on them and I'll get in trouble here. So, okay, right? Sarah. Yes. How are you? I'm doing great. All how right. are you doing? I am as well as can be expected for this early hour in the morning. Let's talk a little bit about this program that we've been talking about this morning. It's Shop Small, Win Big. You designed this. It's got an app that goes with it that is supportive of the merchants. Go from top to bottom. Tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, so actually we acquired this, uh, it was another program called Little Boxes, and we acquired it, we changed the name to Shop Small Win Big because mm -hmm. there are lots of incredible prizes that people can win. They get raffle entries that the app tracks. And, and the app, before we go too far, is Kudo, K-U-T-O. Yeah, Is that right? right. Kudo, right. and you can download it on your thing. It's kind of a payment processing thing. It has a list of all the 100 or so merchants that are on the program. And you essentially pay with your phone yes. through a credit. It's linked to a credit card, right? Well, actually, no. Uh, we partnered with the folks at Kudo a while ago because we really like that they, s they help small businesses not pay high credit card fees. So it actually links to your checking account if you choose to use that. But you actually don't have to pay with Kudo. It's just a way to track raffle entries. So you can if you want. You'll get double raffle entries if you do. But you actually can pay with a credit card. You can pay with cash. Um, you can track your um, raffle entries through the app, which makes it really easy. But you can also use a paper. Um, we have mm -hmm. paper entries that people Those can Those fees use. that the, the merchants get, that they have to pay to the credit card processors are, are significant enough for people to uh, make an issue out of it. And this kind of kudo thing kind of answers that, right? It definitely, it, it, yes, it definitely uh, reduces those fees significantly. Yeah, um, yeah so we, we love them, and um, and so they've come on board to host this on their app. Uh, but the, the overarching thing is, you know, our small businesses, they create community, they inspire us, they help us shop with intention, so we feel good about what we're buying, and right. we feel good about the gifts that we're giving. And small businesses share so much love for the community. You know, you can't go into a big box store and the folks are going to remember your your yeah. name and remember what you bought last holiday season for the kids. Uh, but these small shops do. And um, 
you're a great spokesperson for the cause. I know you could go on and on, but I can't let you because I'm getting the wrap here. <laughs> Shop small, win big is the name of the program here, Emily and Kelly. Uh, you can download that app on your phone, and it's a credit card kind of a pro payment processing app, I should say. And again, it takes a smaller chunk. It's a local company. It takes a smaller chunk of those processing fees than the big processors do, and that helps a lot of small businesses, keeps more money in the community. As it says, it shows the love. When you start shrugging your shoulders and raising your hands and talk about sharing the love, I know what you're talking about, <laughs> and so do a lot of small merchants. Keep them in mind this holiday season. Yeah, good idea. Thanks, Cor. And and, and the cool way to check out some of those shops, too, where just in that one shop you get to see yeah. all different kinds of local yeah. makers. And it, it may seem cool like stuff. that app is just a you know, small impact if you know just you you does it and sets it up. But if you get a lot of people in yeah. the community using this, you can really be a big impact for if, all those small companies. If most companies. of your consumers in a day you know, are able to not pay in a credit card that takes a slice yeah. out of that uh, shop, that's really good mm -hmm. business for, for our local economy. So mm -hmm. great idea and a chance to win some cool prizes. Yeah. Love to see it.